Example two, given the function y equals 4x squared plus nx plus 8, and determine the value for n so that y has a minimum at x equals 2. For the function y equals 4x squared plus n times x plus 8, this is a polynomial degree 2. The graph is the parabola graph. It opens up. It's going to give you the local minimum value. And based on the general graph property, I'm going to read it. General graph property. At the lowest point here, the slope is zero. And the slope is the y prime. And the y prime occurs at x equals two. So that means y prime at two equals zero. So this is the concept for this problem. And to help you to set up to get the answer out, our goal is to find the value n that satisfy this information. And based on our information, we can now find the y prime, which is four times two x plus n plus zero. The n is the coefficient. So we just uh, use the basic derivative to get the n as a derivative of the n times x. Or we can rewrite it as eight x plus n as the y prime. And at the local minimum, the y prime is zero and it occurs at x equals two. Therefore, eight multiplied by two plus n equals zero will give you n equals negative 16. Then put them back together. So we have the equation, or sorry, it's a function. So the function in the full version would be y equals four x squared minus 16 x plus eight and at x equals two, the function y will have the minimum value or the minimum point of the graph.